Hello friends, you might have heard about four battles which are known as Anglo-Mysore War and in this video I am about to deliver some light on the first Anglo-Mysore War. Blinded in the north, the Britishers wanted to have a direct contact with the Madras through the northern Sirkars. So, in 1766, they signed a treaty with the Nizam of Hyderabad. As per the treaty, Nizam of Hyderabad surrendered four of the five Sirkars immediately. Gantur, the fifth Sirkar, had been granted to Nizam's son as Jagir, and it was to be surrendered to the Britishers at the death of Nizam's son. In return, Britishers were to pay Ruby Samalak or support to the Nizam in his war against the Tipu Sultan's father, Hadar Ali. Meanwhile, Hadar Ali had already some territorial disputes with the ruler of Arcot. He had differences with the Marathas. Suddenly, when Hadar Ali saw a common friend of the Nizam, Marathas and the Nawab of Karnatic, he played a game. He bought the Marathas and allured Nizam with the territorial games. Along with the Nizam, he launched an attack on the Arcot after a cease of struggle for over half, one and a half year. Hadar Ali turned the tables and appeared at the gates of Madras. pan Britishers Britishers in Madras signed a treaty with Hadar Ali which came to be known as Treaty of Madras. It was signed on 4th April 1769. This Treaty of Madras ended the First Anglo Mysore War. As per the treaty, the Arcot was to be returned to the ruler of Arcot. Britishers and the Hadar Ali promised to help each other in case there is a foreign invasion on any of the two. And this treaty of Madras was also based on mutual restitution of each other's territories. I hope. You enjoyed these things and in the next video we will come with the second Anglo Mysore war. If you like these videos please press on the bell icon and like our videos and for any query write in the comments. We will try to modify those things. Thank you.